Hey everyone, welcome back to Digital Live 2014 here in studio, sponsored by Ideal Life. We've got my good friend Stanley Yang, CEO of um, NeuroSky. How are you doing? Pretty good, Tim. Nice to meet you again. So we caught up a demo, it must have been 2010, I think, 2011. That's, yeah, yeah, That's yeah. right. So I uh, love to see the advancements of the technology, see you again. So what brings you out to CES this year? I know you're on the panel. Yes, I just came off the panel. It's called the, uh, the Sixth Sense is Digital, yeah. which means the last time I count, I still only have five, yeah. but I'm, uh, I'm counting on all these di digital devices to tell me what, what my health are or what my uh, body is doing, yeah. and that's my Sixth Sense. That's why it's digital. So tell everybody, you're probably wondering what's on my head here. So I have something attached to my ear. Right, so you have a, uh, what we call EEG headset. Um, we call it My Way Mobile as a product name. It detects your brain wave and uh, it converts that from the brain wave into a digital signal and then we feed it to uh, a device like this. For example, it's an iPad. Is this Bluetooth? Uh, correct, it's yeah. Bluetooth. And the, the ear clip is just a ground, so, so it's, it forms a loop. Um, so what we're seeing is here is that this is your uh, brain wave in uh, motion, your raw brain wave actually. And then uh, if you do me a favor, just blink three times. And we see one, two, three, we just saw three, three peaks. That's your, so it not only detects your brain wave, it detects all kinds of your muscle signals as well as if you place it on your wrist, like in my watch here, it, it can detect your um, heart. Uh, conditions and, wow. and situations. So this year our theme is all about the body and mind. Yeah. Uh, the sense, the, it's wearable sensors and they're being integrated into wearable technologies and gadgets. And it, it, it either measures your mind or your body. And you have a new product this year. Correct. So um, we have a, this, this, uh, the bunch of uh, sports wristbands, um, digital watches like, or, or smart watches like this. So in this case, for example, we can see that there's a, there's a uh, watch, normal, re re regular looking watch. If I, hold on a second. Hold on. There you go. So if I um, flip it, and then I place my finger here, oh, all this, sorry. Now we can see my cardio signal, and you're seeing your brain wave at the same time. Oh, wow. So there's the heart and there's the brains. It's called mind and body, quantified. Pulling it all together, that's really impressive, Stanley. Thank you. So, so what are you taking? where are you taking all this? I mean, this is really fascinating. Mm -hmm. Well, um, this is just the base technology. Um, consumers probably don't need these d different signals to tell them how they're brain wave look like or how their cardio signal look like. But after translating them through algorithms, we can tell if somebody's under stress, uh, if you're wearing the watch or something, if you're under stress, um, it gives you a little warning. Maybe, maybe you're, you're encountering stress or uh, most importantly, it, it kind of tracks your daily routine and health and gives you minor suggestions and, uh, or suggestions for minor adjustments. Yeah. So it wouldn't be so inconvenient when you finally break down and, and have to go to a, you know. have a bad day. Yeah. So uh, what types of folks are you trying to meet here at CS and get out of the program? Uh, actually, we're here mostly to support our customers, and yeah. many of them have integrated our sensors into their devices, uh, such as these, and uh, we're wearing our customer devices. And um, I make sure that they have a good program launching into the consumer world. So um, in, in upcoming year, we're going to see a lot of these uh, wearable devices, uh, not in addition to just motion tracking and, yeah, and yeah. calorie count. They're beginning to take data from our body and make useful um, functions and features out of that, in, uh, you know, maybe on your mobile devices. Uh, very cool, very cool. It's always a special treat. I mean, this pretty exotic. Oh yeah, this this is the most expensive of all. It's um, it's a titanium case with a crystal uh, glass on top. Yes. Uh, most of them won't be this high end and expensive on the floor, but um, this one's the b best one. How many of these are out? Like handful. Probably, uh, I would say fifty to a hundred thousand wow. out. Uh, this was launched in the middle of last year. What's it called? It's called an Arrow Watch by uh, Toshiba. Toshiba, yeah. cool. All right, well, that's Stanley Yang always bringing some super impressive stuff and a good part of the digital health family. How do people connect up with you? 
Uh, you can look up neurosky.com, N-E-U-R-O-S-K-Y.com, and you'll find information about us. Very cool. Good to see you again. Thank you, Tim.